Hey everyone, welcome back to Electricity Frenzy, your go-to channel for all things electrical. Today we're going to be talking about a common problem that many of us face in our homes, air fryers tripping circuit breakers. We'll be discussing the causes of this issue, as well as some solutions that you can try out. There are several reasons why your air fryer might be tripping your circuit breaker. One reason is that your air fryer is drawing too much power from the circuit, which can happen if you have other high power appliances running on the same circuit. When too many high power devices are connected to the same circuit, the circuit can get overloaded, and the breaker will trip to protect the circuit from overheating. Another reason for your air fryer tripping the circuit breaker could be a faulty appliance. If your air fryer is damaged or malfunctioning in any way, it could be drawing too much power or causing a short circuit, which would trip the breaker. A third reason for your air fryer tripping the circuit breaker could be a bad circuit breaker. Over time, circuit breakers can become worn or damaged, which can cause them to trip more easily or fail to trip at all. If your circuit breaker is old or has been tripping frequently, it's possible that it needs to be replaced. A fourth reason could be a wiring issue. If the wiring in your home is old or damaged, it may not be able to handle the amount of power required by your air fryer. This can cause the circuit breaker to trip as a safety measure. Lastly, the issue could be caused by a low-quality extension cord. If you're using an extension cord to power your air fryer, make sure it's rated for the appropriate wattage and length. A low-quality extension cord may not be able to handle the power load of your air fryer, which can cause the circuit to trip. Now, let's talk about some solutions to this problem. The first thing you can try is to unplug any other high-power appliances that are running on the same circuit as your air fryer. This will reduce the amount of power being drawn from the circuit and can prevent the breaker from tripping. Another solution is to use a dedicated circuit for your air fryer. This means having an electrician install a separate circuit specifically for your air fryer, so it doesn't have to share power with other appliances. This can be a more expensive solution, but it's a good long-term fix if you use your air fryer frequently. If you suspect that a bad circuit breaker, a wiring issue, or a low-quality extension cord is the cause of the problem, it's important to have a licensed electrician inspect your electrical system and address any problems. So those are some of the causes and solutions for air fryers tripping circuit breakers. Remember to always practice electrical safety and never attempt to fix electrical problems if you're not qualified to do so. 